Yes, yes. What it do, cuz cuz? It's your cutty, Slick, and I'm here with another cool video. Ya I mean? The face off of the Galaxy Note 5 cases. Adi adi. Now here we are, the face off between the Galaxy Note 5 water resistant phone case or the water resistant slash waterproof punk case for your Galaxy Note 5. Let's get straight into it. Okay, which one should you buy and get? Well, after this battle, hopefully, I'll help you decide. Now, the water resistant Galaxy Note 5 phone case, this one right here, you get for $14.49, which is 15 bucks. You know what I mean? And the waterproof, water resistant slash punk case, you get for, 40, for $39.99, which is 40 bucks. Big price difference in the range. Now, between the presets of the product, the punk case wins. It's nicer, bigger, pictures. You can see the product. You feel me? Description of what it could do. Where the water resistant just says water resistant in the brown box. You see what you have on the, on the back on this side with the little hole, but it's not as fancy as a punk case. So the punk case wins around, wins around on that one. Now, let's crack it open. So I can talk about these phones. All right, the water resistant phone case right here. Now, you do get the flaps at the bottom. As you can see, it will protect your, uh, your ports. This is not waterproof. It is only water resistant. So you cannot, you cannot submerge this in water because if you do, you will damage your phone. Water will seep through and it could damage your phone. It does come with different changeable backs that you can choose from. So whatever outfit you decide you're wearing, or whatever color you're rocking, you got your phone to match your outfit. I like, it. gooey. Now let's get straight into the punk case. Punk case, nice presentation off back. I'm gonna open it up. Now inside, I'm gonna talk about a lot of them, the pros and the cons about these. See the slip right here on the side, you crack it open. And on the inside, it comes with the uh, with your wipes, your your lanyard, and then it also comes with a um, with an auxiliary cable cord to screw on the inside for your auxiliary cable. All right, now we're gonna get straight into it. The pros and the cons. All right, we're gonna start with the punk case first. The punk case it is water water resistant slash waterproof, dust proof, shock absorption, the whole nine yards. Clear case, scratch prone, and won't won't catch scratches uh, that easily. You know what I mean? But it is a fingerprint magnet, so you're going to have to keep wiping. But uh, overall, it, it's, a cool, it's a cool case. Definitely digging the colors. Diff does come with different colors. It's got the white, black, teal, purple, red. Wherever, you, wherever you color you decide you want to flow with, you can go ahead and rock with. Now, the cons about this, it falls apart. I'll be lying to y'all, as you can see right here with the duct tape, that's the port that covered the bottom of your charger port to keep it waterproof. All right. Now, this thing is waterproof, does prove the whole nine yard, but for your everyday use, it's a fail on that one. I'm gonna tell you why. Let's put this in here, get it out. Ah, get that, let's take it out of there. I'm gonna tell you why. The flaps, use it too much, pop it on whatever. It's we it weakens the flaps, the grooves and everything, and then plastic will start pretending to break off, like this one is. That broke. The flap right here, the where you keep, you gotta keep charging your phone up and down. You know, open it, open and closing the flap, it breaks. You know what I mean? Now my only on my other uh, punk case, this right here broke off. So now. Whenever, whenever I decide I want to take this off to plug in my auxiliary cable cord, 
this comes off with it. It's not attached no more. Those are the cons about this. You cannot, this is not an everyday use type of uh, phone case to have for your phone, for your Galaxy Note 5. The pros, cool kicks in, coming with a built-in kicks in. Little, it's a little soft fleet, so you gotta be careful when you open and close it. You know what I mean? You see the stickers on the back right here? Because I had an iron ring and I had it stuck on there. You know what I mean? The sound. Sound does come out nice and nice and clear and loud. You know what I mean? But it funnels down and it will shoot out in the back right here. So you get that, you know, try to get a clearer sound. But other than that, fingerprint scanner reads okay. Every once, sometimes it unlocks it, sometimes it don't. Uh, you know, like I said, it's a cool, it's a cool uh, phone case to have. Get the ultimate protection, but at the same token, if you're not, if you're doing it for everyday use, I, 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 mm, I mean, I wouldn't really recommend it. I mean, only, only you have this case if you're going to the pools or something like that, going to the beach, uh, or, or anything like that. Anything that you near water, have this case. But for your everyday use, it's a no go because it will weaken the flaps, will weaken everything, and everything between the crack and break. Now. The water resistant, cheaper, cheaper phone, phone case for 15 bucks. Um, let's talk. Let's talk about the cons. The cons about this is between these two, you can see how the grooves right here on the side, the power button sticks out a little bit. This blends in. Vine rocket on the punk case sticks out. The water resistant one for the uh, uh, sub case blends in. I mean, it's a big deal, not really, but if you're tight, if you're not really used to your phone, you will, and you're trying to push a button, you will gonna have probably gonna be pushing, pushing everywhere because you're not feeling the grooves of the button that you're trying to push. You know what I mean? Um, the front. Use your S Pen a lot, as you can see right here. You can see little scratches. It's not, it's not too big. I mean, you can still wipe it clean. You feel me? Still make it look, make it clear, clear on your phone. You know what I mean? Still make it look nice, whatever. But it is prone to scratches. Um, my keys hit the uh, scratch right here, did a deep scratch, and it was game over for this phone case. You know what I mean? And then if you got a screen protector on your phone, you cannot put it inside with the screen protector already on your phone because then the, in, the this part, the screen protector would stick on your phone, causing to have a bubbles and all that stupid stuff. So that's the only cons about this. Now the pros about it, Easy access to your ports, S Pen and ports, grill speaker at the bottom. Definitely hear your uh, your sound or your uh, or your uh, the value or your uh, sounds and everything, your music and everything that come out the phone. Um, I mean, hands down, it, it, it's a cool phone. Oh, another con about this, my bad, is it is slippery. Better grip with the punk case, slippery with this. So if you weren't meant during the wind, it will slip out your hand. So I advise you get something like an eye ring. Put on your phone and rock out. You know what I mean? Both could do wireless charging. Both could charge, take cable cords easily. That's fine. This one better. This one get you gotta have a standard USB uh, charging cable cord. If you got a fat one, it won't fit through here. Make sure it's regular Samsung and it will slip and slide through. But other than that, overall, I'll say the water resistant case. It's a good everyday phone to have, hands down. Ultimate protection. You drop it, your phone's still protected. You know what I mean? You ain't worried about the S Pen popping out or anything like that. Where if you drop this one, <sighs> it's doable. I mean, it will protect your phone, but you gotta kind of worry about the flaps. Cause if it don't hold and it pops open, the S Pen gone. Water getting inside, the whole nine yards. I don't know, I don't know. But hopefully, this may y'all make a good choice for y'all which phone case you want to decide you want to get. Like I said, my 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 best is a water resistant, cheaper, definitely digging the ports. Not waterproof, but definitely water resistant and dust proof. Um, clear screen. I mean, you get clear screen on both of them, but this one hands down, I, I'm I'm definitely loving. It. Wireless charging, the whole nine yards. I mean, it's beautiful. Beautiful, take a picture with the camera. I mean, it, it, it's gooey. Clear, clear, everything clear. So for me, the water resistant, hands down. But if you're near the water, 
going to the beach, get the punk case. Hands down. Punk case is a go. Like I said, see, see the flap? That's the only thing you gotta worry about. But other than that, you can submerge it underwater up to three feet. You're good to go. You can rock out. But if you wanna use something for everyday, everyday uses for ultimate protection, go with the sub case. Cheaper, save, your, save money in your pocket. Good. Well, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. And like always, before I go, ladies, fellas, say it with me. You punk rock busy. Don't hate what I got. Just picture me rolling and watch I rock. It's your cutty, slick, and the mind is busy. Yes, yes.